Hi everybody, welcome to another Make It Yourself Monday. Today, we aren't making an instrument. We are going to make a mask. We're gonna talk all about masks today and why they're important for us to wear and they keep us safe. We're gonna make our own mask too and have a lot of fun learning about how masks work and playing with them today. Playing with masks is a great way to help kids understand what they're for and to help them feel more comfortable when they're around them. So today we'll be making a fun mask that you can play with. This isn't a mask that you can wear out in public to keep the germs away, but it's a fun way to play and a great way to help kids get used to the idea of wearing a mask and putting a mask on themselves. Today's craft is pretty simple. We have a link to this printable download on our blog and we'll put the link right here. You can click there and download this today. Once you've printed it out, what you do is just cut around the edges. Now that you have your mask cut out, you're going to poke holes right where these two circles are. You can use a hole punch or you can use a pencil to do this. Now that you have your holes poked through your play mask, we're going to cut some string to tie into those holes so you can put it around your face or around a stuffed animal's face. Once you have your two pieces of string, thread them through the holes that you made and tie them on the edges. Now that you have your string on your mask, you are ready to decorate. You can add stickers, use markers, crayons, colored pencils, anything to make your mask look fun. Now that you have your mask decorated, we're gonna to listen to a story about why masks are important and how they keep us safe. Bring your mask along and we'll play together. Hi everybody. We're gonna sing a story about masks today. I brought my friend the Minion here with me to help me talk about wearing masks. I'm gonna put his mask on him and then a mask on myself. You can put your mask on too and play with us. Now that our masks are on, we're ready to play. Let's read my story, The Task of the Mask. What are you wearing that covers your face? I'm wearing a mask and it's in the right place. Where is our mask? That's right, it's on our face. It covers our mouth and our nose. Great job! Well, let's see what's next. To stop germs from spreading from a big achoo! That's one of the things that a face mask can do. Do you know what a big achoo is? It's a sneeze! That's right! Our face masks help keep our sneezes and our coughs inside so that they don't touch other people. We can also use the corner of our elbow if we need to achoo, sneeze. Try it with me, achoo, good job. My minion has his face mask on to protect him too. So now he doesn't get any of my sneeze on him. Well, let's see what's next. It works like a cover to keep germs inside. Our very own mouth where our germs should reside. The Minion's face mask is helping him keep his germs inside. We want to keep our germs to ourselves. That's how we keep ourselves and other people safe. So where do our germs stay? Inside our mask. That's right. A face mask is used like a protective cape. So when we are talking, germs cannot escape. Whoa, he looks like a superhero. He's helping protect everyone by wearing a face mask. That way, all of his, hmm, what are we trying to keep inside? Do you remember what they're called? Oh, that's right, they're germs. We wear a mask so we can be superheroes and help everyone keep their germs 
inside so that they're safe. Great job remembering about our germs. Well, did you know that germs are not easy to see? Although people spread them and quite easily. What do you see in this picture? Oh, it's two people shaking hands. Do you think that our germs can be on our hands just like they can be on our mouths? You're right, they can. Germs can be all over our body. So we need to be careful to keep our hands and our bodies to ourselves, just like we keep our sneezes and our coughs to ourselves. Nice. Let's see what's next. Germs don't have a color nor a shape that is clear. We don't have a clue when the germs are really near. Well, look, this mom is helping her son with the germs on his hands. What do you see? What are they doing? They're using hand sanitizer and scrubbing their hands. Can you show me how to scrub your hands? Ready? I sing twinkle, twinkle, little star when I scrub my hands. Try it with me. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Up above the world so high, like a diamond in the sky. Twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. All done, and our hands are clean. Great job. You can sing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star while you scrub your hands with hand sanitizer or soap and water. Well, now we know that we have our masks to keep our germs and keep everyone safe. And we use hand sanitizer and soap and water to get the germs off of our hands and bodies. And we keep our hands and our bodies to ourselves to keep everyone safe. Well, Mr. Minion, can we find more out about these masks? I think we can, let's see. Ooh, try this. Take your mouth, your mask off. Can you find your nose? Nose? And can you find your mouth? Mouth. Good job. Let's see what this says. Germs travel through noses and mouths, it's true. That's one of the things many germs like to do. Well, where did it say the germs travel through? That's right, through our noses and our mouths. That's why we have to be careful when we chew and keep our germs to ourselves. What's another way we can keep our mouth and nose germs to ourselves? Do you remember? My minion's wearing one. That's right, it's a mask. Let's put ours back on. Now our germs are safe inside. Great job. Face masks are used, you may see them more each day to help folks stay healthy and keep germs away. Just like my friend the Minion is wearing a mask and I'm wearing a mask, you might see more people wearing masks. We're wearing these masks to keep our germs to ourselves and stay safe. Look. Both of these people have masks on. And they're saying, hello, hi. They can still say hello and hi. They're just saying it through a mask to keep everyone safe. So make sure you say hi when you see people wearing their mask. They still want to hear you say hello. 
You may have a mask that can cover your eyes when playing pretend it's the perfect disguise. Oh, have you ever played with an eye mask to play superhero or pretend? Let's take our face mask off and put on an eye mask. Ooh, are you a superhero? I like your eye mask, but oh no. <coughs> Did my eye mask protect my coughing germs from getting out? No, it didn't. It just stayed on my eyes. <coughs> and my cough germs went everywhere. What kind of mask do we need to protect our mouth and nose germs? That's right, our face mask. Put it back on. <coughs> now my germs stay inside to keep you safe and keep me safe. Good job. <gasps> oh, look. Is he wearing a face mask or an eye mask? That's right, he's wearing a face mask like me and my friend the Minion. But this one is different, it has a big task to catch nasty germs, that's the job of this mask. Do you remember, do we need a face mask or an eye mask? to cover our germs. That's right, we need a face mask, just like the one I'm wearing, and you're wearing, and my friend the Minion's wearing. Look, that doctor is wearing a mask to keep him and his patients safe. Well, let's see. There's no need to worry nor feel less at ease. A face mask holds germs back and catches each sneeze. You don't need to be worried when you see people wearing a face mask. It's still the same person, just under a mask to keep you and me safe. My friend the Minion here still likes to work for Gru and likes to do many fun science things. But he has to wear a face mask now to stay safe. That doesn't change what he loves to do. He's still the same person. Just like you're still the same person when you put on a face mask. Can you put your face mask on a friend or your mom or dad? When their face mask is on, do you still know who it is? Oh, I bet you do. That's because it's the same person under the mask. They're just keeping you and me safe with a mask. Very nice. I think our story's almost done. And always remember, because it's true, each person's the same. It's just the mask that is new. Just like our book says, everyone is still the same and wants to say hi and hello. And it's the same person just now with a mask to keep you and me safe. So don't be afraid to wear your mask. Know that it keeps you safe and you're a superhero by helping keep other people safe when you wear your mask. I hope you had so much fun decorating your mask and trying it on, keep playing with it. You can put it on stuffed animals, you can put it on a friend or a parent, or you can make more masks and have everyone in your family try it. Great job wearing a mask for this video and stay safe. Keep those germs inside, wash your hands, and keep your hands and your body to yourself. Thank you so much for playing with me and my mask. I hope you have a great day. Bye.